Okay, everybody, two days ago it was 70 degrees, and now this is what it looks like outside my house. Okay, everybody, as you can see, um, it's snowing out. Uh, when you watch this video, it's going to look like it was shot in like June or May or June or something. The weather has been great last week, um, kind of weirdly great, uh, 70 degrees, record, record highs. I went fishing pretty much every day, but I had a really hard time catching anything um, other than trout. And I'd already done a couple trout videos. One of the things I try to do is mix everything up. I try at least not to do the same video like right in a row. I want some something in between there that's a little different. So um, I wasn't going to do another trout catch and cook or anything until I did caught something else. And again, I've been trying to catch a bluegill for this this online fishing dad tournament, and we have I've had two videos where we got skunked one one from Viv's point of view and then one from my point of view, even though I did have something on um, out multiple other times for short periods of time, not catching anything. So the good part about this video is I finally catch something. Uh, the fish were just starting to wake up in the uh, kind of in the smaller bodies of water. Um, I don't have a lot of small public bodies of water around here. I mean, not a ton of small ponds, so pretty limited choices. Um, I did see somebody at the spot I, I was at in this video uh, catch a largemouth bass. Um, I saw a big largemouth bass, probably three or four pounds. Saw a big carp. So the fish were kind of starting to wake up, but they weren't super bitey yet um, as far as I could tell. And uh, in the first part of the video, I take Miles, my, my youngest, he's five years old. We went out fishing for a little while to see if I could get him to catch some trout. Um, we only lasted about 15 minutes or so and, and uh, we needed to come home, which you'll see in the video. Um, and then later in the day, I went out by myself and then you'll see uh, the, the lengths that I go to to uh, catch something when I haven't caught anything for a while. All right, uh, here we go, enjoy. It's winter time back here again. Uh, California trip is coming up in less than two weeks. So super excited about that. I'll probably have some um, stuff on gear and, and stuff. Just some, I have a couple of reviews and things that I have coming up before that. So might get out fishing again before then. I hope so. Um, maybe do another trout, uh, open water trout video. And then uh, we're probably hitting the road. All right, thanks for watching. Here we go. Doing a good job. Slow down just a little bit. Oh, a fish came up for it. He almost got it. I saw a fish go after it that time. Here, let's try again. He just missed it. You got to reel just a little bit slower, okay? He just missed it that time. I saw him come all the way up to the top of the water. Here you go. Yeah, perfect. Just like that. Let's see if he come back and get it this time. Keep it going. That makes it look like a little fish that they want to eat. Keep reeling. It has a little spinner on there and it looks like a little fish in the water. Do you want to stop? Okay, stop. Look, I'll show you what it looks like. See, look. Hold on, it didn't spin around very good. Here. See how it spins under the water like that? Hold my hand. Hold it. You do? Well, it's way over there. So can you hold it for a little while? Can you hold it? Or do we have to go home? Okay, well, let's go over here for a little while and see if we can catch a fish or two. I see some jumping over here. Big old, look like a big carp down here. Lots of down trees. I'm gonna try to get down here and fish. I don't know if I can do it, but.
Oh, sunfish. Hey, hey, hey. We finally, finally got a bluegill. It took a lot of work to get that little guy. Whole week. But I think I got a good spot here. Let's get a quick measurement on you. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on, little buddy. You hold on there, little buddy. He almost lost him. He's not going to be a tournament placer, but I have been trying really hard just to catch a bluegill, so. That one is five and a quarter. All right, back you go, little guy. Let's see if we can improve on that. Let's see if I can get out there a little deeper. Fish on. There we go. Another five incher maybe. Same size as my last two. Ooh, that was something a little bigger. They jumped out there. Ooh, mm, this one might be just a tad bigger, but not much. Five incher. There we go, this one feels uh, about the same, I guess. Thought he was a little bigger, he hit it pretty hard. All right. Well, I got the skunk off. I'm gonna scoot down, see if I can get something bigger. 